right, here we go. All right, let's see. Our required passenger brief, you know how to operate the doors and seat belts. The brakes look tested. Fuel selected for both. Avionics master, off, primer, master on. Obviously. Auxiliary fuel pump, where is that on the stack? It's the white switch right above the primer, but it should be good to go. We don't, okay. probably don't, don't need it. it. Okay. Clear prop. VFR the north. All right. Hooks ground, Cessna 4221 at United. Uh, negative ATIS at the moment uh, for a northbound departure. Cessna 4221, hooks ground, taxi to the triangle for your run up. Expect runway 17 left for your northbound departure. To the triangle, expect 17 left, 221. Okay. Yeah, that's flying Charlie Papa. Uh, a few days ago, uh, and you can really tell this thing's got a bigger engine in it. Okay, let's go to 1800. Juliet, say Juliet, uh, flight following VFR starts Ignition, left, right, back. Propeller, cycle three times, let it drop what about 500 RPM? Just as soon as it starts dropping, bring it back up. Okay. Did you watch an E for me? Yep. Sorry. Bearing 7, Whiskey Victor, it's ground runway 17 right at Charlie. Forward. Taxi via Charlie, you can do your run up on the alpha. Okay. Bring RPM. Uh, check oil. There you go. And November 7, 1 Juliet, uh, say request. We're just going to fly. Uh, what, yeah. you, what you're really doing when you do that is you're, you're just trying to get the oil and the, and the prop up circulated. Okay. Right. Check out the oil, all, all, all the oil out of there. I see. Start to shoot down. In this case, you would not be getting a squat code. Um, however, you can monitor the frequencies that approach control yeah, for traffic. Got to cycle that stiff. Roger. And November 7, 1 Juliet. Hold short of runway 17 right at Charlie. And contact him on 118.4. 118.4, 71 Juliet. Hook ground, gun smoke maintenance at the alpha ramp. I need to cross 17 right to the northwest ramp. Okay. Back to 1000. Gun smoke maintenance, hook ground, cross runway 17. Hook's tower, Cessna 4221, holding short 17 left approach, ready to go. Cutlass 4221, hook's tower, roger, stand by, landing traffic. Waiting for landing traffic, 221. And I, I forgot to check, you're your checkout, so we're going to do one performance takeoff, so we'll do a short field takeoff. Okay. Pretty much same, the same, same thing you were just talking about. Just flaps down. Three mile final, twin system. With information, pop up. There he goes. Roger, say your call sign helicopter. Cutlass 4221, runway 17 left, cleared for takeoff. You need a right or a left turn to the north? Left turn to the north works. Roger, left turn to the north is approved. Traffic off the departure end and left close traffic. 4221, clear takeoff 17 left, left turn approved. Traffic in sight, 4221. Okay. So we got lights, camera, and action. Oh, you wanted a short field, right? Yep. Well, you can, you're probably rolling. Let's go ahead and give it a guess. Yeah, let's go ahead and do that. All right. RPM, manifold pressure, everything's in the green. Cine line. All right, airspeed. I see you in the form of turner final. Hit the brakes. Just 19 in the form rudder. Oh, well. I got you. Have to hold a lot of right rudder on this baby. Yeah. 
All right, no more runway. Okay, no more runway. Gear coming up. Doesn't have three lights. It just no, has just one. one. Just the one. Just the one. Gotta feel that sucker get up. Oh yeah. Tower Baron Triple Seven Whiskey Victor. Your video's gonna be cool. The gear on these things. Yeah. Yeah. Short of light. Okay, we're about 500 AGL. Just about here from traffic and your left now. Maybe not want to turn. Correction. So up here we come back. We're seven one Juliet Roger. Yep. Uh, frequency approved. Uh, the departure frequency down there is one two three twenty. One twenty three eight twenty five. The pressure are already there. All right there. Okay. And he's climbed up about eighty five. Nice little cruise time. We'll go up to one thousand five hundred. Uh, good afternoon. I was over with the Delta. Nine visibility one zero. Ceiling three. Let's go over the lake. Are broken. Temp All right. Two five two point one six. Altimeter three. Not a bad place to maneuver. Usually, you got some pretty good low gaps. Yeah. On the GPS. Seven whiskey Victor. Traffic. Oh, we're looking at the right side. Yeah, there's twenty three. Twenty three is giving me an indicated at one hundred twenty eight. Oh, one twenty nine. Bring it back to about twenty and twenty three. Twenty and twenty three. Yeah, twenty and twenty inches of manifold. Okay. Right, so. Good. Let's go to 2,000 feet. 2,000, okay. We'll see what level these. I think this cloud's about 2,800. Yeah. 3,000, somewhere around there. So, 25 uh, by network. Let's go. Cruising down. up. Oh. We just leave leave the prop where it is. Just go to full nope. power. Go prop up to 25, and then go to 25. Okay, prop first. Yep. Then 2,500, or 25 inches. Yep. Okay. Yeah, whenever, whenever you want to make a, a power increase, prop goes first. When you make a power decrease, manifold goes first. Okay. All right, so leveling off, we come back to 20 on the manifold. Yes, sir. And back to 23, was it? Yes, sir. That, was, that gave us a pretty good speed, about 100, 100 knots or so. Wasn't it? Yeah. Okay. Let's do some uh, uh, some clearing turns. We've already done a cruise checklist. Oh, okay, good. Come over here to the left. Oh, the one thing we'll turn off landing and taxi. Okay. Do so much practice area. Cut this four two two one over like on road two thousand feet. Currently northbound. Uh, we'll be doing steep turns. West practice area. Okay. All right, we've done our clearing turns, we've done our cruise checklist. First thing, first maneuver we'll do is we'll just do some steep turns. Okay. Uh, already blow maneuvering. Just whenever you're ready, we can go to the left. All right. Let's see how this baby handles. Yeah. Now in this case, yeah, you can just you can just bump up a little bit of RPM. I mean, a little bit of manifold. Yeah, it could require a lot of. Gotta be jacked up to hold this thing up. Oh yeah, this isn't too bad right here. There we go. And we are to the west. Not too bad. Not too bad. Back to the front. Like you put the uh, control force into it and just wait on it. It'll get so. there. Pretty good. That should be a pretty cool view from your camera too. Yeah, thinking. that should turn out real well. Um, okay, seat cards are very good. Let's do some uh, slow flight. All right, so, so you're gonna just all the way forward. Yeah, this, my checklist for seat gumps is going to be cow flaps and car feet, gas on both undercarriage. Right, it goes down, so you can go put the landing gear down. Okay, you're coming down. 
Alright, so there's your green light. Green light. Uh, undercarriage is down and locked. Got one in the mirror over here, so we got to have a mirror. Oh, okay, cool. Mixture is where it needs to be. Mixture's got to bump it up a little bit. Cool. Alright, so we're ready to go now. You can just start dumping flaps in there and giving in a slow flight. Alright. Freeze. Already down at 70 knots. 30 degrees flaps. So we're down to 60 knots. Losing just pad. Alright. 50 indicator. Give me a left turn heading of 210. 210. Into, uh, yeah, that's awful. All right, left turn heading of one two zero. That's there we go. Uh, all right, this looks pretty good. I don't see any problems with this. What we're gonna do is transition from this to power off stall. So let's go put the nose over for me, and uh, gonna just bring the power back all the way to idle. Back and to idle. Yep, we'll do a power off stall. Okay. The recovery's gonna be nose over, full power, flaps. Uh, flaps gear, flaps, flaps. Okay, so there we go. Full power. Yep. Nose nice. down. Flaps to 10. Gear up. Is gear supposed to come before flaps? No. Uh, gear's after that. That's going to okay. be flaps up. And, flaps then, are and don't do do not do gear until you get a positive rate. Okay. Um, you, then you take the flaps out. Because you want to leave the gear down in case you sink and hit the runway. Right. Uh, that's what you're really simulating. And so then you take the flaps out after that. Okay. So positive rate, flaps all the way up. I have a friend who has a horse farm right down here. Really? Let's go check it out because you lost your engine. Okay. Yeah, that's your gear warning horn. Okay. So why is that? Uh, when you get below 12 inches.